Don't you fucking dare float off! Not now! Come on, gotta get the fuck out of the city! Think they make these motels especially for royal fuck-ups like us? AC's busted, dirty needles under the mattress, shitters clogged. No, for real. Who fucking comes here to sleep? We're a couple miles outside Night City. Someone leaving town just keeps driving. What good's a motel? I'll tell you who sleeps here. Fucking losers, that's who. Fuck! How the tables have turned. Johnny, for crying now out- we're the ones sitting around- Waiting for Sokka assault squads to storm in. Anyone knocks, blast the fucking door. No warning. Not keen on us and enough. Hear that? Car. At this hour, in this place? Fuck. Just one? Finger on the trick, V. That door. I know you're in there. Are you asleep? Time to wake up. Who's there? I said, who's there? Oh, want the whole motel to hear, or will you let me in? I'm armed. Don't try anything. Finally. Ugh. That on the wall, is that... Blood? Yeah. Knocked the last star off this dump. So, you were saying, got a message? Sitting right here. Oh, at 
It'll start soon. What'll start? It's a doll. Or a proxy. I must make one thing clear. I still think you are mad, but... Hanako. That you? But I can fool myself no longer. I believe you. How'd you find me? Did you really think it would be enough to leave the city? Takamura mentioned he had placed a tracker on you. Yet even had he not, when Arasaka wishes to find some... Porcelain bitch. Damn shame you didn't believe me earlier. Goro might have still been alive, had you? If you invoke his name, remember he did everything for this conversation to happen. That demands respect. Fine. Yorinobu planted a tanto in the corporation's very heart. I must act while the wound is fresh. And you will help me. You are living... You're gonna help me first. Perhaps I did not speak clearly. We must act quickly. Well, I'm pretty tight on time, too. Dying, in fact. My dead body would make for a pretty lame-ass witness. I understand. Want to know everything you know about Mikoshi? Mikoshi? One of my father's flagship projects. A data fortress with servers situated on orbital stations all around Earth. Think of it as an archive of personality constructs, digitized psyches. Try a prison. A matter of perspective. In any case, that is not where you will find salvation. Not without extensive knowledge of the relic and the construct creation procedure. Track down your runaway. Hellman was hiding under Kang Tao's wing. We chatted. Think sooner or later the engram will completely consume me. Process can't be stopped. A surprisingly deterministic conclusion for a man of science. At the very least, I got my hands on the relic schematics. All useful. Even more so, given that Hellman is still alive. I will contact him and explain that one does not leave Arasaka by the back door. All I know about constructs is that one of them's out to kill me. Got no idea how it wound up in the relic. Or how to remove it. There is only one possibility. Soul Killer. Or rather its newer, more powerful version. You must acquire it. Me? That's our Arasaka tech. Technology my brother does not allow even his closest associates to touch. My hands are tied in this matter. That's about the extent of what we've got. What now? I am sending you my private line. Contact me if you acquire more information about Soul Killer. And only then. From this moment onward, we both must exercise extreme caution. That's my job done. Know what? What? Think I'd have rather had a wave of Sokka leads barging here. We got what we wanted. Don't tell me that proxy got to you. Fuck you. Come on, think about it. Yesterday, Hanako was living in a world that was completely safe for her. What she got on her hands now? A foreign city, a homicidal brother, and a fucking thief. It's why she sent a proxy. She's alone. And she's shitting herself more than we are. Uh-huh. Clink. What? Did you say clink? Mm-hmm. Sound of her attaching her leash.
Gotta admit, Corpo Cut. What the? Fuck! It's the damned ship. My silver handosis is clearly incubated. That appointed finger I hear in your voice? Fuck! That was your ticker. Sit and rest. Don't need your flat running while we got a job to do. Blah, blah, blah. Fuck Arasaka. Blah, blah. Smash Mikoshi. You really are turning into me. Can't say I'm excited. Because you're a manipulator, an egotist, and a cynic. Every time you op- You know, we get along as the need arises. Maybe it's time- Got no idea where I'm going. Be a living legend. That's all I wanted. Test of a person's true value? Death. Yeah, maybe. What was it like when you died? Was on top of the world. Failure not an option, not a thought. Till it happened. Now? <laughs> Makoshi felt, I don't know, like sleep? Lacked awareness, had no sense of passing time. Didn't mark it. Did what they wanted to me. I just remember cold, a black void, fear. Or, or was that your death? <coughs> Koshi, why'd Arasaka even build it? If I could only see inside Saburo's head. Uh huh. People can be bought, brainwashed. But it's only in Makoshi that you can peer inside a soul, pick it apart, reprogram it. They've amassed quite a collection. Scary talented runners, soul killed, packed away. Probably using them now, probably controlling them. So, ruling hearts and minds, that's what it's about. The usual. Corps have always tried to shackle people one way or another. Saburo's ambition is greater. Well, I think I get why you did... Shouldn't exist. Of all the destruction and pain corpse wreak around the world, what happens at Mikoshi is worst. Know why? Because you're trapped there forever. It's eternal. No, nothing's eternal. And for the Psyches and Mikoshi, no such thing as the passage of time. Worse things when they switch up your identity, and you never even know you've become someone else. Corps have already taken the world for their own. Now they're coming for us. Realize what you're doing to me is what our sock is doing at Mikoshi. Yeah, I know. That's why I'm gonna fix it. Let's move. Get back to work. Let's do.